Checkpoint has revolutionized DLP by utilizing its user check technology to empower end users to remediate their incidents in real time. Innovative multi-spec data classification combines user, content, and process information to make accurate decisions, while new Checkpoint self-educating network-based DLP solution frees IT security personnel from incident handling and educates users on proper data handling policies, protecting sensitive corporate information from both intentional and unintentional loss. Checkpoint DLP protects sensitive information that's sent over the three most commonly used communication protocols, SMTP for email, HTTP for web, and FTP for file sharing. This video demonstration will show you how easy it is to deploy and start using Checkpoint DLP to effectively protect sensitive information from being leaked. Once the DLP appliance or DLP software blade has been properly installed and configured, all of your corporate data protection policies are created and administered from the Checkpoint Smart Dashboard via the Data Loss Prevention tab. When you navigate to the DLP tab, you are presented with the overview window. In this window, you can quickly see the status of DLP security gateways and incidents and access the windows for the most urgent or commonly used management actions. In the Data Loss Prevention Policy window, you can view and edit the rule base on which your DLP policy is built. The simple rule base policy allows you to define the following. What data you want to protect, multiple data types can be added to a rule. Which source users or networks you want to target, these could be Active Directory users or networks and hosts defined on the security gateway. Where the sensitive information is going, which protocol the sensitive information is being sent from. Options are SMTP, HTTP or FTP. Multiple protocols can be added to the rule. Exceptions to the rule. What action to take if the rule is triggered. Detect or let the data pass. Inform or let the data pass but the user will be notified. Ask user will prevent the data from leaving the organization until the user remediates. And prevent will outright block the data from leaving the organization and the user will not be informed. How to track the rule. You can alert specific data owners via email. Log the incident in SmartView Tracker. Send an alert to SmartView Monitor send an SNMP trap to a dedicated SIM solution, or send a customized script alert to another machine. And finally, define the severity of the rule. Data types are the building blocks for the DLP rules. With over 250 predefined data types, ranging from personally identifiable information, such as usernames, passwords, names and addresses, compliance-related data, such as PCI data security standard, and intellectual property data such as application source code and CAD diagrams. You also have the flexibility to create your own data type objects by using keywords, regex patterns, corporate document templates, file attributes, compound data types, dictionaries, or using Checkpoint's advanced scripting language, CP code. What makes Checkpoint DLP unique when compared to other DLP solutions is the Checkpoint user check client. This lightweight client allows end users to remediate their incidents in real time and educates them on your corporate data security policy. Now let's see what the end user experiences when they trigger a DLP rule that's configured for user remediation. When a user sends confidential information over email, they are immediately alerted by user check to remediate the incident. Users have the option to send, discard or review the issue. If the user decides that the confidential information contained is of legitimate use, then they are asked to provide a justification for sending it. Checkpoint DLP's self-educating feature can recognize a threaded email conversation so that users don't get burdened with duplicate alerts. When a user sends confidential information over the web, user check immediately alerts the user and gives the option to send or discard the sensitive data from being uploaded. Checkpoint Smart View Tracker gives DLP incident reviewers a user-friendly view of all the incidents that have occurred. You can immediately see which users were in violation, what DLP rules were violated, and the severity of the incident. Selecting the incident will present a window that contains a greater amount of information and is presented in a well-structured manner that allows incident reviewers to efficiently take action. This is the end of the video demonstration for Checkpoint DLP. Thank you for watching.